crazy. would have been bad. Alright, not bad. I'm gonna run them a few more times. lines. That felt pretty good. All right, here we go, another tire review. Gave the WTVs a try. And I did three rides on them. Don't like them. Uh, I was gonna get the judge to replace the trail boss, but I don't know. I looked at my videos. I compared each trail that I ran. Uh, you know, WTB against the Maxis, and the Maxis were just 
a lot faster. I was rolling down trails a lot faster. Um, kind of seemed like I was maintaining more control, uh, better lines with the Maxis. So I'm back on Maxis. This is the Maxis Askai 29 2.5. Uh, I just went with the 3, 3, 3C Max Terra, you know, XO protection. Uh, it's the standard, but these actually kind of feel tougher than the WTBs. Um, pretty flexible, pretty nice. Um, I do like the lug pattern. Um, feels more stable. Um, it's kind of a cross, well, it looks to me like a cross between like an aggressor and a DHF, but what a game changer this tire is. It actually, I feel that I was more stable on this than I was on the Vigilante in the front. And yep, back on the DHR. First run, as you can see, no chunking, no tearing. My first run on that Trail Boss, and it was already shredding. So, again, these are the, you know, the light compound. Um, I shaved about half a pound from the WTBs. The WTBs were 1120 grams each. Um, I wanna say this DHR is 955 and the Askai is 1,075 grams. But today, a uh, total game changer for me. Uh, total confidence. Uh, I felt very stable. I felt really good in the turns. Um, I was able to pick lines and hold them better. And I felt like I was rolling faster, even though, you know, the DHR2 isn't exactly a fast rolling tire. Neither really is the Askai, even though it's got the ramp lugs in the front like you can see here and here but i loved it i was so happy with this um so much it gave me so much confidence that i actually did hawk for the first time today um not my greatest run it looks really bad but i did it and now that i know i can do it i'm just going to keep riding it over and over until i'm just able to ride it like i do yucca uh, cactus, grasshopper, and shoots. So it's gonna be more practice, uh, more runs to memorize the trails, and super happy, super happy with my ride today. I did really good. Okay, so also changed out from the Wolf Tooth Fat Paw to these ODI Rogue Grips. Another game changer. These things are super, super tacky. Um, you can see how. Uh, I guess call them lugs. Really soft, really supple. Um, felt really good. I had really good grip um, down every trail. I actually noticed that I didn't have the death grip like I do with the uh, Wolf 2 Fat Paws. So very pleased with these. Um, just the pure grip, you know, I'll wear gloves, but the pure grip on them my hands were actually more relaxed and i felt good um usually i come off and my hands are a little bit kind of sore sort of uh more just from having to squeeze you know having that death grip but beyond pleased um yeah i'm, I'm gonna be staying with these tires Th these are my tires of choice so very happy uh these things seem to wear better than the wtb i mean i didn't have the wtbs for very long but just three rides and you know, the back of the lugs were just shredding. They were just tearing away. And that was just three rides on them. Um, wasn't happy. So I am very happy on these. So this is gonna be my tire choice I'm gonna stay with. So probably get back out tomorrow for a ride. Um, yeah. So, I'll see you guys out there.